And now we come to the special feature of our program, the appearance of our mystery celebrity, for which my friends on the panel have had to blindfold themselves once again. All blindfolded, panel? Mm -hmm. Good. Will you come in, mystery challenger, and sign in, please? panel, as you know, in the case of our mystery challenger, you go to a different form of questioning. You ask one question at a time, in turn, moving clockwise. We'll begin it all with Bennett Sturge. Well, the whistles usually mean a beautiful girl, and the raucous excitement usually means movies. Are you a female connected in any way with the moving picture industry? Yes, sir. Miss Francis? Are you here because you are shooting a picture in the evening? No, ma'am. One down and nine to go, Mr. Fay. Have you recently... Uh... Have you recently started a new television show? No, sir. Two down and eight to go, Miss Kilgallen. Do you sing professionally? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Well, now, wait just a moment, if I may. I want to have a small conference. <laughs> Yes, ma'am, remains in the books. Mr. Sir? Well, do you do something else that is a lot better known, possibly, than singing in the movies? Mm. Yes, sir. Miss Francis? Are you a freelance performer rather than someone who is signed with a studio? A freelance reporter rather than one who works for a single studio? Yes, ma'am. Mr. Payne. Are you better known for one picture in the last uh, 14 months than any others? Uh, uh, no, sir. Three down and seven to go, Miss Kilgallen. Uh, are you fair-haired rather than dark? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Sir? Have you got the Donna's collection of hats in Hollywood? <laughs> And your name might be Hedda Hopper. And so. Now, how did you get it? The voice? Because I thought the voice was disguised. Yeah. I Actually, always you know were a doing wonderfully, voice. but I think it was to John's question. I heard a familiar tone, which I, everybody would know was yours. Well, of course, I've tried all day whether to use the high voice or the low voice. Well, you take and the high voice, and I'll take the low voice. Way <laughs> down, I way down here. And then that sounded like me. Or Tallulah, and I didn't know which it sounded like, and I thought you'd guess it, so I went up high. That's and you would high. have to do it. Uh, but oh, I, you've yeah. done rather. You know, you're actually three down and seven to go. Oh, it's pretty well, that's good. Very They're sweet. Very sharp. May I, may I borrow your <laughs> audience for a few seconds? Yes, ma'am. I'm sure all you people out there know about the community chest and the United Funds, and you know what they do for your community. So this year, it starts this week, and it only comes once a week. And your donations help the young, the old, and the sick. And those of us who have our health, let's give generously this year and just a little bit more than we gave last year. Shall we? Thank you. Ah, nice piece, Thank you very much. Well, I must say that you've done rather well tonight, so we'll have another contestant after this word from our alternate sponsor. <laughs> 